Okay, there's a there's a pretty pretty grim boss fight coming up now. now. What what happens with this guy is if you get away from him at range, he will throw fiery boulders and I'm pretty sure the, these things will one shot me. Hopefully he won't throw them at me if my boys are around him. But if he does, I've had it. I'm just keeping an eye on that Blight Fiend's health. Get my skellies back. I don't want to be hit, thank you. Resummon the Blight Fiend. He's not throwing it. Oh, he's bringing the roof down. That's also not a good thing. There, that thing. That's the thing that stuns you and then you just die. Come on, boys. Get in there and fight him, though. Ooh. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I'm talking about. You've almost got him. You almost got me. Yeah, see, that's not good. That skill's not ready. Ooh. This is looking a bit worrying, let's get out of here. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, that was too flipping close. Blight Fiend, you need to fight him, mate. Oh, no. Right, hang on, hang on, hang on, I've got it. I mean, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna run away to the main menu unless, unless it looks like I'm really close to dying. That was pretty close to dying. They've got him. They've got him. He's dying. He's dying. He's dying. He's dying. Oh. <sighs> right. That was. Um, yeah, I knew that was going to be a bit grim. I hope that was fun to watch. That. I want to watch that back and see how close I came to dying there. But yeah, what, what I'm saying is, I'm, I mean, in any fight where it goes a bit iffy, it'd be very easy to just pause it and quit to the menu. But what I did there was paused it and had a look at, um, I thought, yeah, my health pot's not on cooldown anymore, so I can heal as soon as I come out of that menu. So that I don't want to be, you know... I, I'll give you something decent to watch. If if I just run away to the main menu every time it looks iffy, it's not going to be much fun to watch, is it? I mean, you, you know, you keep repeating stuff. I'd have to go all the way back in there and do that again. This area is quite dangerous as well. It's like if you get a whole bunch of spiders and all sorts up here, and some of these boss goblin things. Yeah, what I'm going to try and do is, I, if I can get, um, if I can get the blacksmith sorted out. Oh God, while I'm talking, I almost died. If I, <laughs> if I, God, if I can get the blacksmith sorted out. I don't know whether I've got, have I got any? Yeah, look, I've got an H and heart. I've got a feeling. I mean, it's a slight cheat because I'll have all the. Relic blueprints that I've got, but it depends where you want to draw the line. Do I, you know, I can't pretend I can't pretend I haven't got the blueprints. And once you've got a blueprint and read it, you won't get it in a drop again. You might get in a quest rule, but you won't get in a drop. So, wait a sec. Yeah, look at that thing. He's coming for me. It's
that guy there, that they're a bit of a I don't want to get anywhere near him. Yeah, what was I saying? I don't know. I think what I'll do is I might cheat with the relics. I don't mean cheat. I mean, as soon as I open the blacksmith up, you'll have a whole load of relics that I can craft. Because this character's in a save folder that I've been using quite extensively. Got a whole load of level 100s on it in hardcore. So I'll have... Um, I was assuming I get there. I, mean, I think I deserve it. I think... I think I deserve a halfway decent relic. I mean, I still craft it, and I won't, I won't, um, I won't craft it from stuff that's in shared stash. I'll have a look at what I've got in my inventory, and I'll only craft a blueprint that I'm able to craft from stuff in my inventory. I think that's fair. I mean, I'm saying all this. I could die before I get the blacksmith at this rate. These um, witch doctors heal everyone else. They were right pain in the neck. There's, a, there's some massive boss spiders there. That's got a one-shot death written all over it. Subjugator's toxic... Okay, that, sub, that might be good as an offhand. That might massively buff pets. If I can get it. 34% all damage. Right, hang on a sec. Where's that gone? Can I even use it? 36, oh, I can't. Spirit, okay. 34% all day, yeah, see that'd be all right. Ah, uh, where's that massive spider gone? I'm gonna try and get to the blacksmith without aggroing that spider. Yeah. There it is, oh God. Yeah, they're gonna. This is the problem, right? Hang on, they're distracted. Okay, let's see if I can do this. What I'm gonna try and do is get across here while my pets annoy that spider. Move along now, strength. Duncan needs it. It's time the hammer was passed on. I'll see his work close. Thank you. <sighs> right. This will get me to the next level, cashing this in, and then we'll have a look and see what relics I can use. I mean, there'll be loads, but I've got a craft of myself, so. Right, 31. Almost, th oh, that's good. Almost got to 32. Right, stick a point in there. One point in there. Two points in there. Hello, Duncan, my old mate. Right. Let's see what... Hysteria... Okay. So it needs ectoplasm, which I haven't got. I haven't got ectoplasm yet. So what it's shown you there is what's in what's in stash. I mean, I've got... Oh, it's blood, blood chthon as well. So I can't... I haven't got a blood chthon. I might get one. Soon, but I doubt it. Ancient heart. Right, what else have I got? What level, level's that? 25, what level are these things? 50. Alright, so what else I got? Death Chill's quite good, but I'm not going to be able to craft that. Mistborn. Is uh... anything else? Allies. Guile. Guile granted by item. Disability, blah blah. What's it do? Inspires your allies. Okay. Death chill. Can't even. Yeah, it's no way. Oh, a manticore. Yeah, so I can't make a death chill. It's a damn shame. Um, hmm. And see if I can cheat over here. Let's have a look. Cold stone. I could make one of them. How many of those do I need? Four of them. Right, I've got seven. So I can legit make that. 
four of them, four ether crystals, I've got eight. So I can legitimately make a cold stone from the stuff I've got in my inventory. If you look at what that does, chilling weapons, bonus to pets, cold damage, cold damage, frostburn damage. So that enchanted flint, same thing. Okay, four scrap, I've got five. Four Syrian embers, I've got nine, so I could legitimately make that. That's fire damage to pets. Hmm, lightning damage to pets, what's that need? Oh. Cracked lodestones, I've got seven. And then you've got this void oh, purified salt, rift stone, void weapons, chaos weapons to pets. So yeah, interesting. I could I could make a cold stone, and I could make an enchanted flint, legitimately with the stuff I've got. Stick one on there, one on there. <sighs> yeah, could do. Let's see if I can get some better weapons first. Right, am I looking for devotion at the moment? Two. So I was going to go down here. This doesn't do pet stuff. Shame, see, that would be all right on Blight Fiend, but it doesn't do... Does this give pets? Yeah, whereas this... Fire damage to pets, but none of them by default do fire damage fire damage and there's that mm. I don't know whether to get that first just to keep the light fiend alive acid damage and that's chaos damage poison damage it's hard to know so I could just go full-on panic and get something like that but it's just uh, I want this to be interesting to watch not just me going oh I'm, I'm gonna try and stay alive I mean, yeah, obviously I'm trying to stay alive, but... Right. Actually... Let's go and see how bad Viloth is. At least I'll get up to level 32. scrap right boys get in there take those doggies out what level are they 33 30 okay yeah i suspect the viloth fight is just going to be i i could very well die in the viloth fight i should be putting stuff on ready let's have a look spell mutated scales i've got five of them Shoulder, chest, leg, and is that ancient armor? I'm sure an ancient armor plate. There's one there. Let's put a few of these on. So where does that chest and leg, shoulder, chest? Okay. So stick. Oh, don't want to waste it. Okay. Come on, get me up to level 32. Yeah, that thing's shooting lightning around, that's not good. He's dead, so that's alright. doing point in physique 
I want to get up to that. Oh, actually, I can put a point in there. Let's do that. There you go. See this the Viloth fight because Viloth is considerably harder than anything else you fight on the way there, and they're not really having an easy job of any of these fights. Fiend does a good oh. for a minute there, I thought maybe, but. They're trying to fight those spiders, what are they doing? Yeah, that doesn't work, boys. You've got to be in their face. All right. Go. What does that have a lot in here? Untamed. <gasps> okay. Oh, plus two to summon familiar. Trouble is that belt's got all that resistance. Oh, actually no, that's the one that's on the ground. Okay. Well, you all saw that drop. That is awesome. I'm having that <laughs> straight after I put that flipping thing on it. Oh my god, what's hitting me? Right now, I should have. Oh, poison resistance is almost. Oh, I've got to stop doing that. This isn't normal, mate. You, you can't do that in normal, in hardcore. You've got a hardcore ultimate. You've got to watch what you're doing all the time. You can't just start messing around in your inventory. Look at those fireballs coming in from up there, look. Right, get up there. Take them out. They're wusses, but they hit hard. I think that's what's going to get me is um, nonchalance. Nonchalance will get you every time when I'm just talking and looking at my inventory and something will just one shot me. And that'll be a shame because that'll be a real rubbish way to go out. I mean, if it's a boss fight and I died due to not doing it properly then fair enough but if one of these things gets me with like a random shot of lightning I won't be too impressed <laughs> with myself I'm just like... you know what's going to happen now I... <sighs> right I'll, I'll do a, I'll predict what's going to happen now sack oh, I've got a minute to think yeah because this isn't too bad but what what will happen is it when I go through that door down there I reckon there'll be three really bad news hero spiders and they'll all just hit me at once and that'll be it I almost see that coming right let's get these boys sorted out and wait for their cooldowns to go back off yeah, this door here. When you go through there, you can you can have hero spiders right there. Um, I might have to quit. I might have to quit out. I might have to escape and quit out. This could, you know, I've got my finger over the escape button. Just so you know, right? Get ready. Hang on, I'm going to pause it. Mm. Okay.
Like, get in here, boys. Let's kill these so they don't come up behind me. Right. Not one too bad. It's, it's, it's just the luck of the... The luck of the spawns. I've, I've come through here before in Ultimate, and this whole area is just... I hear of spiders all over the place. They could be down here. They could be just... I'm not going to run... There's one or two, see if we can pull them individually. Yeah, see, they're not hero ones, so they're just going to go straight for the Blight Fiend. The trouble with the hero ones is if they do some kind of massive AoE thing. Area, if they do an area attack, it might be strong enough to just take me out straight away. Which nobody wants. Well, I don't want it. You do. <laughs> You're a watching guy. Come on, kill him. Right, let's work my way around the back here. Do this, trying to pull too many of these into the fight. Yeah, see, Blight Fiend's pulling... Spawn him quick. Blight Fiend's pulling most of the... Uh, most of the aggression, which is good. I've just got to toughen him up so he lasts longer. I mean, it's all right resummoning him, but it'd be good if he just survived a bit longer. It is tempting to put that guardian thing on him and see if that gives him attack damage converted to health. I might be all right with Viloth. I don't know. I... I'm going to try it, but I might have to run away. Ooh, see? You just get hit once by something. and the trouble with Viloth is he puts that... Um, he does all sorts, and he puts that cold stuff on the ground. Yeah. Keep an eye on the Blight Fiend's health and my health. Although, by the time I see my health go down, I'll probably be dead anyway. Get in there, Blight Fiend. Yeah, that's going to need a shard. I can't even do... There's trouble with that one. If I get a shard, I'll have to come back and do all this again. <laughs> Skellies are still on 8. There's Viloth up there. Right, let's try not to pull him down here just yet. Although saying that. No, he hasn't moved. He's just sitting there. That's good. Here he comes. I wonder if they can start shooting him while he's up there. He's going to put that thing on the ground. That's what I don't want to be standing in. Here he comes. Right, have a go, boys. I've just got to watch he doesn't put that thing on me. He's putting it on them. How are they doing? Yeah, on that tsunami that he does as well, I don't need that on me. He's coming after me now. That's not good. Get away from me, mate. Yeah, do not come near me, Viloth, you muppet. If I stay there, I'll be safe, I think. Because that rock, is if he shoots that tsunami, it won't hit me. Well, I don't think it will, unless he comes around here. Have they got him yet? Right, Fiend, come back. Ooh, what the... We did him. Me and the gang did Viloth. Right, okay. I tell you what, that, that I thought that was going to be a lot harder. I did think that was going to be a lot harder. He didn't drop his ring, but whatever. So I haven't got a shard, and I'm not going to cheat on this. I have no, I have no ether shards. It's none have dropped yet, and this is going to require one. I haven't got them. That's in stash. I'm not going to do that. I'm not cheating. Pain. I'll go back and sift through all this. Right, I'm not going to fight anymore in here. I'm going to go and cash this in because hopefully 
this quest will give me quite a lot of XP. Hopefully. It's going to get me to 33, isn't it? Hopefully, right, I'll, I think it'll get me to 33 and it'll probably get me to, an, like, about there on 34. You like clearing out those? Well done. Oh no, sorry, but I meant it will get me to 33 and then, yeah, I thought it was going to get me to 33 and then get me up to about there. But it got me to there. Okay. Live with that. I've got Master of Death yet. How many more? 47. So I've got one more level up. One more level up will get me max like 50 and then I'll be able to start putting points into that. Right. Actually, I've done it all here. I can go and meet Bourbon inside the prison. This might get me up to 34. Some of that gear I picked up was 36, wasn't it? Oh, God. Almost. 150 DC rep. How do I get to Burrich? I'm ready. So if I got to frenzy with these guys, they'll tolerate it. Well, this isn't going up as fast as I was hoping it would. That's a bit annoying. Can't even do the fabric. Well, <laughs> yeah. Like I'm going to get to Burwich Village anytime soon. 